Hello, Mature Divas. I have an exciting update and news for you about Ozempic and Kusimia. So let's get started. Hi, I'm Rhonda, the Mature Diva, and I'd like to thank you for stopping by on this beautiful day if you're new to the channel. And if you're already a part of the Mature Diva family, welcome back. We talk about all things to empower our health, wealth, and mindset. And today, we're talking about my newest weight loss achievement. If you've seen any of my previous videos, you'll know that at my highest recorded weight, I was 228 pounds. I was overweight, I was miserable, I was unhappy and depressed. My doctor had tried for a long time to get me to try new methods but I was reluctant okay I was downright hard-headed but once I heard that 228 pounds it really made me realize how serious things were I was put on Ozempic and I started losing weight now not the 20 pounds a month but I consistently started losing weight and at the end of the year I was 50 pounds down now it's been a little over a year and I'm at 55 pounds down. So I'm checking in, I'm answering questions and I'm keeping it real. And speaking of keeping it real, please hit that like button and subscribe button. We are growing this channel and I can't thank you enough. You know, the last few months have been a challenge for me. One of my beloved pets, baby girl passed away and that led to depression and I wanted to use food to cope. I'm very grateful for being on the medication. You know, in the past, I would have taken my grief out on cupcakes and alcohol, fried foods, chips, and just a lot of empty calories. I was not able to eat any of those bad foods due to the casemia and that led to me walking more and I already liked walking so that benefited me even more and it was good for my soul and my mind and I was able to walk through the grief. I'm happy to report that I'm much better now and baby girl will always be in my heart and I'll always have fond memories of her and I'm so proud that I was able to give her a good home. So I'll pivot and share with you that through this process of walking more, I am now down 55 pounds. I now weigh 173 pounds, and here is the new photo of my scale. And it gets even better. I was out at the mall and I noticed that my jeans felt a little loose, so I wondered if it was time for the next size jean. So I strolled into Old Navy, tried on a size 10, and they fit. So. Here is my new photo of me and my size 10 jeans. So let me frame this for you because I haven't worn a size 10 since high school, 1985. So you can only imagine how good I feel. And if you tried to lose weight for some time, you know how this feels. This is amazing to be only four pounds away from the 160s. I am working so hard and I plan to be there by the end of this year. I'm taking you guys along on the journey with me. So I wanna know what questions you have for me regarding Ozempic, Kasemia, walking, or what I eat in a day. I'm gonna be producing more videos about my daily food intake, what I eat for the day. So put those questions in the comment section below. And if you're a diabetic and you need help tracking your food intake, I've developed a diabetic journal and tracker. I'll show it here and I'll link the information below. This journal is gonna help you keep track of what you're eating and drinking and help you stay on top of things so that you can have a meaningful and detailed conversation with your doctor in order to develop the right plan to help you lose weight. You know, part of my problem was my prediabetes. Another part was my overeating. And yet another problem was me not knowing which foods to stay away from and how exercise plays a huge role in help regulating everything. I appreciate you spending time with me today. And we have recently reached the 200,000 view mark on our channel. 
And I want to thank you so much because we could not have done this without you. We are on a fabulous path together. Roll with me. We're going to lose the weight. We're going to get healthy and we're going to stay fabulous.